The devastating floods that hit South Yorkshire hit around a week ago and they're still causing chaos and in fact there is more rain on its way potentially. So we've come down to Stainforth Community and Resource Centre to have a look at the volunteering effort put out by the local community. All this equipment here, what you see, what is, has all been donated from HMP prisons in Hatfield. As you can see here, we've got cereals, boxes and boxes of cereals. We've got brushes here, we've got all, this, all these mops. We've got clothing, we've got boots, we've got raincoats, blankets. Everything has been donated from the prison, which came in two nights ago. And, and how much of a difference does that sort of make? It makes a big difference. The amount of damage that's been caused over in Fish Lake is unbelievable. And all what you see here will be used. These people over in Fish Lake, they are so, they're just so proud of what everybody's doing for them. You know, it's, you've got to see it to believe it, to be honest. Oh, it's been a massive community effort. Uh, everyone's just come together, just overwhelming, really. But every, like I say, every 10 minutes, every five minutes, there's stuff coming constantly. Uh, myself and some of the drivers have been taking stuff out. Fish Lake, Bentley, uh, we're going to Sprock Bentley, which has been another affected area. And basically we're just taking out, as requests come in, we're talking, liaising with other organisations and other volunteers in different areas and just taking out what's requested really. Some of these people have been left with nothing, you know what I mean? And uh, if, if it wasn't for us, you know what I mean? Bless them, you know what I mean? And, uh, and some of the people are still in their homes are too proud to come out, they don't want to leave their homes. So we're having them to take things to them, you know, to make sure they've got hot meals and they're okay, which are checking a lot of some elderly people daily. It's awful to see. It's obviously people's livelihoods have just gone. Um, but obviously we're all trying to do everything that we can to help them. So fingers crossed it'll be a little, little bit of relief for them. Everyone's come together and like it shows on all the donations and stuff that's here. This is nothing compared to like what we've already take, taken, do you know what I mean? And I put a, a message out saying that anybody needs help, get in touch with us at Resource Centre here. Let the Resource Centre know in Stainforth what supplies you need, where you are and we can get them to you. I like to think that if it happened to us, they'd help us and I feel sure they would. But what can I just say? Stainforth usually gets a bad press, but I think when you look out there, there's a lot of good community and a lot of good people in Stainforth. And I think Stainforth has pulled it out and they're brilliant, every one of them. And I'm honoured to be here to do this, to help other people. Do you feel confident that you're going to be able to overcome if, if there are more floods? Yeah, I think we can do it. Fish Lake can't thank us enough. They are so happy. 